Exodus chapter 34 verse 24. I will drive out nations before you and enlarge your territory, and no one will covet your land when you go up three times each year to appear before the Lord your God. The same God who promised Abraham that he would enlarge his borders will enlarge your borders also. In Genesis chapter 12, the Lord promised Abraham that he would give a land of milk and honey. The Lord had said to Abram, Go from your country, your people and your father's household to the land I will show you. So Abraham took all his relatives and went to Canaan the promised land. Afterwards this promise was enlarged as his descendant Solomon reigned over many kingdoms. For we read, And Solomon ruled over all the kingdoms from the Euphrates River to the land of the Philistines, as far as the border of Egypt. These countries brought tribute and were Solomon's subjects all his life. 1 Kings chapter 4 verse 21. Likewise according to his precious promise the Lord will keep increasing all your borders. When he starts blessing you he will keep on blessing you. He says, I will make an everlasting covenant with them. I will never stop doing good to them and I will inspire them to fear me, so that they will never turn away from me. Jeremiah chapter 32 verse 40. His hand is a big hand that has created the heavens and the earth and with that hand when he blesses you, you will see increase in every way. Will he not bless you with that awesome hand? As in Deuteronomy chapter 11 verse 24. Every place where you set your foot will be yours. Your territory will extend. The Lord will give you every land where you set your foot on. Inherit this promise today. Prayer loving Father, enlarge my territory. Satisfy me with the finest wheat. Let me have no lack. Give me my own property. Let blessings flow into my life. Let all the struggles concerning my possessions end today. May I increase in every way. Let your mighty hand prosper me. Wherever I set my foot, lift my head there as a blessing. In Jesus' precious name, I pray. Amen.